the Tussle Island Spring Juvenile Hurdle is the next race from Leopardstown then. It's a two mile grade one for four year olds. And at the top we've got Art Patrick for Kevin Meehan, Centre Park's David Hooley, Champion Moose David Robertson, Cool Highlander Martin Leedham, Junior Days Obi Wan, Mount Pleasant for Paul Road, St Nicholas at Wade, Darren Thompson, Angelica Zen, Padre Gogan, Beyond the Rocks, Leon Van Rensburg, Judy T, Obi Wan, Loves No Friend Martin Leedham, Midris Fast, David Robertson, Sparkling Riches, Craig Beckwith, Western Province. Paul Rhodes and he agreed for Graham Clutterbuck. So 15 of them then. Ready for this. Oh no, there they go. Okay, they wait towards the first like most of these headed for the triumph next week, I would think. And Beyond the Rocks is the first one to show with Judy T on its inside and Champion Moose on its outside. Art Patrick is in fourth. Then Midris Fast and Mount Pleasant with Loves No Friend and Cool Highlander as they continue this longish run to the first of the eight flights beyond the rocks is in the lead by about a length to Judy T second as they get over the first they're all safely over the first one or two on tidy jumps most significantly for Midris fast for David Robertson just skidded almost on landing and has now shuffled to the back so they're passing the big screen then past the winning post shortly and they'll swing out for a complete circuit of the track and beyond the rocks is the Early leader leading by two lengths to Judy T on the inside. In Mount Pleasant, going around the outside. Champion Moose is next. Then Cool Highlander in the purple and white stripes. Hard Patrick is after that one. Uh, and then Western Province. And the rest of them almost in a line, with the exception of Back Marcus St. Nicholas at Wade, who's a little bit detached today. That one is probably one of the leading contenders, I would have thought. And one of the top four year old hurdlers of the season, but he's struggling at the moment to go the pace. And beyond the rocks is the leader. Leading by two. The pace must be pretty stiff. In second place also is now Ard Patrick in the green and orange. We have Champion Moose just coming up on its inside. Then on the rail, Judy T. Paul Hyland just tucked in behind them. And then Junior Days is after that one. We have Midris Fast having I mean, recovered from that mistake. Centre Parks is after that one. The Greek is also close up there but they're pretty tightly packed with the exception of the leader as they get over the fourth and beyond the rocks continues to lead by two but cool highlander has now moved through into second with judy t on his inside Art patrick on his outside the two david robertson horses are running well together getting to the leading group wide on the track is mount pleasant as they get over the fifth they've got just six more to take then now and well, three more to take so i say and it's beyond the rocks in the lead then beyond the rocks who leads by two lengths still but now champion moose moves into second cool islander is third and then mount pleasant and midris fast after that on judy t just drop back a little bit as they get over the third from home then comes Art patrick junior days angelica zen trying to get into it nicholas at wade is now making significant progress cutting through the pack but it's beyond the rocks who's the one they've got to get to leads by two to cool highlander in second champion moose third mount pleasant four Midris Fast is going to double handful on that one, but he's got a block door as well. Now he might be getting a little bit of a run through. Angelica Zen is running on here. Comes St. Nicholas at Wade over the second. Last they go. And beyond the rocks then. Swings into the home straight with a lead of two lengths from Mount Pleasant in second. Midris Fast in third. Then Angelica Zen. Then after that one, Champion Moose. Cool Island is dropping away. They're racing down towards the final flight then there. And it's beyond the rocks who's still clearing the lead from Midris Fast in second. Coming down towards this final flight. The leader's been in the lead all the way. Beyond the rocks then comes to it. Gets over it nicely. Gets away from it well. Angelica Zen moves into second. Midris Fast is trying to close on the leader as well. But it's beyond the rocks who's well clear. But they're not going to get to this one. And Beyond the Rocks is going to take the Spring Juvenile Hurdle pretty closely. Pillar to post win for, for that one. Angelica's in was second. Midris Fast was third. And Nicholas of White went on to be fourth. And Sparkling Riches was probably last to finish. But to be fair, most of those horses didn't get into that race at all. And Beyond the Rocks was pretty dominant from the front. We'll probably go off favourite next week in the Triumph Hurdle, I think. Now, Beyond the Rocks, do you want it? For Leon Van Rensburg, Angelica Zen, Padre Hogan second, Midris Fast for David Rawson third, St Nicholas at Wayne for Darren Thompson, Run Award will be fourth, the extra further will do that on a favour next week, and Matt Pleasant for Paul Rose was fifth.